Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome back, friends. Welcome to my channel, Kami Biology Lecture. Uh, in this video lecture, we are going to talk about uh, hematology. Fine. So, first of all, <coughs> what is hematology? And usually, we are going to talk about uh, the introduction to blood. And we also talked about the properties, some properties of the blood. Fine. So, let me write hematology. Hema Fine. So, first of all, what is hematology? Hematology is the branch of medical science fine, in which we study about the blood. Fine. So, branch of medical science. What is hematology? Hematology is actually branch of branch of medical science. The branch of medical science which study about about blood. Fine. So it is the branch of uh, medical science due to which we study blood in a detail. Fine. We usually talked about the composition of the blood. We talked about the properties of the blood. We talked about the specific gravity of the blood. We talked about a blood in a detail. Fine. And so, so now what we are actually talking about in hematology. Fine. So first of all, we in hematology, we usually talked about the uh, composition of the blood. That how the blood is composed. Compu position of blood this is the first thing in hematology we also talked about the properties of the blood properties of the blood and we also talked about in hematology blood cells Fine. The cells which are involved in hematology means we usually call that blood cells. And in hematology we also talked about the function, function of the blood. Function of blood. So in hematology we usually deal with these things. We talked composition, we talked the properties and we also talk about the blood cell as well as the function of the blood fine so in hematology we usually talks these things fine now then what is hematologist i you usually uh, heard this word hematologist hematologist just what does this word means this word means a person who deals or a person who know the detail about the hematology fine or what are the role of this hematologist fine a person who know about the hematology a person who deals with blood a person who know the blood in a detail what are the disease which are caused by blood what are the properties of the blood when a person know about the blood and when a person has a specialist in a blood so we usually call that hematologist Fine. So, what are the important role of the hematologist in our society? We'll be talking, inshallah, in some other videos lecture. Fine. But in this video, we are usually talked about properties of the blood and introduction to the blood. Fine. So, let me write uh, introduction to uh, blood. So, introduction to blood. First of all, blood is the, what is blood? Means blood is a connective tissue, connective tissue. Fine, what does it mean? It means that blood is connected in all part of the body. 
for example if i injury that area so the blood will come out if i injury any part of the body so the blood will come out it means that blood is present in every part of the body in everywhere it is present fine inside the uh, inside our body so that's why we call that blood is a connective tissue mean it is connected in every part of the body fine right so blood is a connective tissue but it is connective tissue in a fluid form na no? in a fluid form fluid form fine fine it is in a fluid form in a liquid form we can say so this is the first thing the second thing is about blood is a fluid of life fluid of life no why we call that blood is a fluid of life because blood carry the oxygen in all part of our body where the oxygen is needed and blood also receive the carbon dioxide and expel out it from the body fine which is very uh, harmful gas for us so blood re, uh, blood transport the oxygen in all part of the body and blood uh, receive and expel out it from the body due to which it improve our life fine that's why we call that blood is a life or we can say it is a fluid of life fine so it is a fluid of life due to transportation of oxygen transportation of oxygen and expel out carbon dioxide expel out co2 due to this property we call that blood is a fluid of life second thing is about that blood is a fluid of fluid of growth now what does it mean it means that blood can transport the nutrients to all part of the body where the nutrients are needed fine and blood can also transport the hormone the growth hormone and some other hormones to all part of the body due to which it can improve our growth that's why we call that blood is a fluid of growth as well fine so let me write they can transport nutrients 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 from digestive system from digestive system and growth hormone from glands fine so they can transport the nutrients to all part of the body where it is needed and they can also trans uh, they can also stimulate the growth hormone in our body fine so this is the uh, so that's why we call that blood is a fluid of growth as well now second thing is that blood is also a fluid of health fine so let me write blood is also fluid of health as well fluid of health fine no why we call that fluid of health we call that fluid of health because it contain defense system fine first thing is about it contain a defense system and second thing is that it can transport or it can remove the waste material from our body through kidney fine so that's why we call that it is a fluid of health so let me write it contain wbc against diseases and remove waste substance through kidney through kidney due to this way we call that that blood is a fluid of life as well fine fine so that's all about the hematology the uh, the some proper uh, some 
uh, introduction to hematology and also introduction to the blood fine so blood is also a transport material as well because it transport everything which is present in our body as well fine so we can say that blood is a life important material in our life important material in our body fine so that's all about the introduction to blood and some hematology fine i hope this video helpful if you like this video please hit the like button share this video and also subscribe the channel watch thank you so much